Justice Minister nominee Cho Guk denied having any role in corruption allegations against his family during a confirmation hearing at the National Assembly on Friday. A key point of contention was alleged fraud regarding his daughter's academic records and college admission, a scandal that triggered public uproar. Cho apologized and denied exerting any influence. He vowed to carry out sweeping reforms if appointed as Justice Minister as a way to regain trust. I accept the public's criticisms and I admit I've made inappropriate remarks in the past, but I believe I will be able to carry out prosecutorial reforms, which has been one of the key goals of the administration. I have been working on it since I was the presidential secretary. There has been slow progress and I hope to be able to complete it. The ruling party defended Joe, saying he is fit to carry out the administration's reform drive, while the opposition bloc called for the scrapping of his nomination. Joe and his family face other allegations, including making suspicious investments in a private equity fund and alleged irregularities in real estate transactions. A two-day hearing initially scheduled for earlier this week was called off on partisan wrangling. Instead, the nominee held an unprecedented press conference to explain himself. But the confirmation hearing is a formality as his appointment by the president does not require parliamentary approval.